the number eight northwest gale or storm wind signal is still in force. At 2 a.m. this morning, Typhoon Nida was located at 100 kilometers east of the Hong Kong Observatory and is forecast to move west northwest with 25 kilometers per hour towards the Pearl River estuary. Locally, winds have strengthened further. Many places recorded gale force winds, including Lavoshan, Tuscan, and Wetland Island. Some areas like Chala, Kwa Ping Chow, and Chen Chow almost reach gale force wind level. From the radar, we can see that the western eye wall has affected Hong Kong just now, and it is starting to depart from Hong Kong. So Hong Kong will enter into a low period with wind strength will decrease significantly shortly. However, members of the public are advised not to relax any precautions because Hong Kong will be affected again by the eastern part of Nida's eye wall. The winds will change the direction from existing northwesterly winds to southwest. So, those places which have been sheltered before may become more exposed and the winds will be much stronger, especially in the morning. At this stage, the Hong Kong Observatory cannot exclude the chance of issuing higher signal and will monitor closely the wind strength, especially during the passage of the eye wall on the ring band. Otherwise, it will still be squally showery with high winds and rough seas and swells. Nida is also expected to bring storm surge in the morning, uh, which may cause flooding or sea level intrusion to the low lying areas. Members of the public are advised to take precautions against flooding. <laughs>